to talk to you a little bit about getting out of your boat, right? So I often have people coming up to me going, Michelle, how the heck do you do everything you do? That's probably the most common question I get. Um, I'm a strong believer in life is short. You have to grab the moment, go and do it. Well, my name is Joy Foster. I'm owner of co-owner of Kimberlite Enterprises, and to hear and to hear today at Windrush Rhinoway at Palgrave, we are featuring our third woman woman to woman event. Our guest speaker was Michelle Taras, introducing her women's controversial art series that literally amplified the voices of women, um, covering from all sorts of things to abuse to everything. It speaks for itself, and uh, the conversation was pretty deep. So now, we're, now we're getting into the into the like art art topics, right? So um, this painting now it actually belongs with the collector, and she was um, nice enough to loan it for me for this exhibit. So this is really the first painting that started this whole idea of doing a series of paintings on issues that affect uh, women in our current society. So this one is called La Femme. And do you all know about the Amazon warriors? Okay, so um, there are a tribe of women from way back when, and it was the women who were the soldiers, the fighters. It wasn't the men. And often they would cut off one breast because when they were holding the shield, it would get in the way. So I really like the idea um, that she represents this show because I made her look very strong. We see the very strong angles, but at the same time, I put flowers to show her femininity and the softer side um, that we all have within us. So she kind of represents to me uh, who we are as women. Um, so now what I, we're gonna invite you to do, so all the paintings are on this side, upstairs, and I would like you to go and look at them and see if you can figure out the stories in each painting. Some, sto some paintings, it's obvious what the story is. Other paintings, you might say, what's going on? Um, so it's, I'm gonna leave you for a few minutes on your own upstairs to see if you can figure out what you would think this painting's about. Um, I have to say, I've been nervous. <laughs> I've been nervous about showing this work because it's very um, sensitive, a lot of the topics. And some of it's a little controversial. Some of you will have completely different opinions on the subjects I have touched. Some of you might be upset. Oh my goodness, this hurts me here. And that makes me a little nervous. But I read somewhere that with great art comes great risk. So my whole point is I don't want to just be an artist that sells to sell. I want to be an artist that's there to make a message, make us talk, make us think and make us move forward. Okay, so should we head upstairs? Women to Women is a platform to ignite women in their walks of life, to empower them, to inspire them, to let them know that they can do any single thing they want. And as women, sometimes we compare ourselves. But what we need to do is support each other in what we're doing. And myself, that is our mission at Kimberlite Enterprises, it's to inspire women, to let them know they have a voice, but to leave a story for other young female women to do what they need to do and to use their voice pro pr productively. They should come to these events because every day we talk about it in our coffee shops. We talk about it, what we want to do. What is it that we can do with our lives? What is it that we love to do? How is it that we get off the couch? How do we learn to love ourselves as women and respect ourselves and those beautiful wishes? They should come and to these events. They should come out and meet women within their communities and surrounding on what they're doing. But most importantly, ignite what you are doing. But most importantly, again, and I keep on saying most importantly, but it's very, very important, is to support. We're a group of women and we've got a large voice and so we should use it. Well, where you find out about it is Kimberlite, K-I-M-B-E-R-L-I-T-E dot C-A. If you even Google Joy Foster, I'm all over the internet. Put that right in. Everything comes up from the shows to the podcast, TV series, and also new things coming in the, coming in the works. 
On September the 24th, we have a dear friend of mine coming all the way from Belleville, Ontario. Her name is Jeanette Arsenal. She is a writer, songwriter, and performer. She is a woman that's very dear to my heart because she gave me the, uh, the choice to, and the opportunity, I should say, to record four of her songs. So she's going to be attending here at Windrush to share her story titled Coming Out of the Dark. She's also going to be performing. It's going to be an amazing upcoming event. Uh, September the 24th, everything's on Kimberlite.ca.